Hi, I'm Kyle from Smart Service, and today I'm going to show you some tech tips to keep your PC running at optimum speed. Your business relies on technology to get work done on a daily basis, and keeping that stuff tip-top tuned is just as important as taking care of your trucks. So let's look at a few things that we can do to help improve that. From time to time, you probably dust the outside of your computer, but occasionally you should actually open it up and clean the inside out as well. Computers generate heat and rely on internal fans to cool them down. Dust can accumulate inside a computer, obstructing airflow and causing overheating. Overheated computers can slow down or stop working entirely. First, make sure your computer is turned off. Then, grab a screwdriver and open it up. Make sure not to touch anything in there unless you really know what you're doing. Next, we're going to grab some canned air here, and we're just going to lightly blow out the inside of the computer. Make sure to hit every single crevice you possibly can there to get all the dust out as possible. Next, we're going to do the same thing with the keyboard and with the mouse. A computer or mobile device approaching storage capacity could be suffering performance-wise. If it's running slower than usual, those old files may be to blame. Let's take a look at a couple options here to help find those files and get them cleaned out. Free tools like WinDirectStat for Windows and Disk Inventory X for Mac can help you identify and isolate which files on your hard drive take up the most space. You can find links to download these tools in the description of this video. I'm running WinDirectStat right now. Each of these boxes represent a file. The big ones are my biggest files, and if I click on them, I can see what they are and where they live on my computer. And if I don't need them, I can delete them to free up space. Another good place to make cuts is your downloads folder. If you don't look at this a lot, you could have gigabytes of old data, install files, and ancient email attachments. Now you might have things that you still need in here, so don't blindly delete everything. Stay what you need, junk what you don't. Finally, both Mac and Windows include built-in tools to help you delete temporary and unnecessary files. You can use these tools to clean up your hard drive. Check the link to our spring cleaning guide in the description of the video below for more great tech tips. I'm Kyle, and this is Coffee Break. Uh -oh.